Hi everyone. So in today's tutorial, we're going to go over how to use Desynchronize for the Mashbooth app. Desynchronize is a free software that copies and pastes photos from one location on your computer to a new location. So the first step is to click on Desynchronize over here. Click on the application version of Desynchronize and then click on the blue button, which is Load Job. And then this screen opens up. Don't get overwhelmed here because it's actually very simple. All you really need to worry about are the left side and the right side here. The left side are your source files. So these are the files that are made by your photo booth software and are stored or saved onto your computer. And the goal is to copy the same photos from your computer to Dropbox, which is going to be on the right side over here. So the left section is your computer, the right section is your Dropbox. First step I'm going to do is right click in here. Click on Browse. I'm going to look for a folder that contains the photo that my photo booth software makes. And that's this folder right here. It's called Photos from Photo Booth. I'm going to scroll down. And this is actually on the desktop, so I'm clicking on that and it automatically made a date for it. And in that date, these are where the different file types are stored from the photo booth software. So the first type of file that I want to get onto Dropbox are my originals. So I'm clicking on Originals. I click OK. I'm going to try to get these over to the Singles folder in Dropbox. So I'm going to right click. Click Browse again. Click on Dropbox. Go to Events and then click on Singles. We called it Singles in a previous video. If you want, you can call this Originals if that's what your photo booth software automatically names these types of files. So again, on the left side are the Originals from the photo booth on your computer, and then on the right side is your Singles folder from Dropbox. Make sure to check this box off, by the way. OK, so right below, I want to get my prints from the computer to Dropbox. That's the second file type I want to get over to Dropbox. So I'm going to right-click again, Add New, Browse, go back to this folder called Photos from Photo Booth, click on Prints, click OK, and then the next step and the final step is to go to Browse again on the right side. Go back to Dropbox, go to Events, and then click on the Prints folder that we made earlier. And then check the box off. And that's all you really need to do. So just to review here, the left side are your photos that are stored from your photo booth software on your computer. The right side are your new folders that you made on Dropbox that are going to store these same photos. You're just transferring over photos from one place to the next. Oh, and one other important thing to note here is each folder needs to stay on the same corresponding row. So singles are on row 1 on both sides, and prints are on row 2 on both sides. And then I'm going to click on Synchronize. And then you click on Real-Time Sync as soon as you're ready to start your event. And then click Yes. And that's all there is to it. From now on, any photos that are taken by the Photo Booth software are automatically copied and pasted over to your Dropbox folder in real time.